NASA today released the findings from its year long study of UFOs and well, it doesn't really clear anything up. It basically says that those strange objects in the sky are well, they're still a mystery and our Rob Hayes is here to explain. <laughs> Yeah, you know, over the past year or so, we've been hearing a lot about these unexplained objects flying in the sky and how the government is taking a closer look at them. Well, today, NASA released its findings, and it's a pretty anticlimactic look at what it calls UAPs. UAP is the new stand-in for UFO. It means unidentified anomalous phenomena. Oh my gosh, they're all going against the wind. The wind. Bill Nelson is the head of NASA today talking about its year-long independent report on UAPs, one that is more down-to-earth than other alien reports. The NASA independent study team did not find any evidence that UAP have an extraterrestrial origin. But we don't know what these UAP are. 33 pages long, put together by scientists and experts poring over encounters like this from military and commercial pilots. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, reports of alien life continue to make headlines around the world, like these so-called non-humans rolled out before Mexico's Congress earlier this week. And in July, a former U.S. Navy pilot telling the House Oversight Committee about his run-in with a UAP off the coast of San Diego. <laughs> the technology that we faced was far superior than anything that we had. But because the mysterious flying objects are still a mystery, NASA will continue investigating them and has appointed a director of UAP research. NASA says the upgraded efforts will work hand in hand with other government agencies and use AI to search the skies for even more evidence for those for those keenly following all these unexplained sightings, NASA is also vowing transparency. There's so much uh, concern that there's something locked up, classified, uh, and that the, the American government is not being open. Uh, well, we are the American government, and we are open, and we're going to be open about this. Now, in order to increase the amount of UAP evidence, NASA is hoping to turn to smartphone apps that can help gather and organize sightings from all around the world. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.